Hey there, Sheepdoggers, and welcome to more Plague Inc. Evolved. Uh, this time, we're going to be doing the Necroa virus on Brutal. Um, just so you guys know, I have a plan for... You can also see here the ones we've actually managed to do. Brutal on Virus, Nurax Worm, and Prion. Not too bad, really, considering they're all fucking difficult. Um, <laughs> anyway, yeah, um... I, I have I have a plan for a subscriber special involve, involving involving uh, involving Plague Inc. evolved and um, it will be coming out hopefully if I can wrangle it um, on on Sunday so uh, keep an eye out for that um, as always with the subscriber specials it's going to be ridiculous so uh, yeah keep an eye out for that video it might be two videos we'll see anyway uh, let's let's move on and uh, we will go with. Popping cure bubbles. Mm, yeah. I might. I think I'm going to go with popping orange DNA. More DNA from popping orange DNA bubbles. Uh, genetic mimic. Your plague is harder to cure. Mutate transmissions. Mutate abilities. Um. Let's go with mutate. Abilities? Let's go with mutate abilities, see what we get there. Uh, suppression, more likely to cross land border, yes. Uh, and we'll get a bonus in humid, maybe? That would help me in... Uh... Let's go with extremer file. And then finally, oh, damn. Okay, these are completely different to the usual ones, so we can't choose these yet. Um, Alright, well, brutal it is. Compulsive hand washing, doctors never go home, and sick people locked in prison. Uh, and we will call it... Uh, what was it? Oh, yeah. This is... Uh, I, was, I was doing a few practice runs on, uh, on Twitch... And we decided to call uh, the um, the the zombie plague capitalism and also porn. So we had a lot of capitalist uh, zombies walking about, and a lot of porn zombies. Um, people, but uh, there there was there was like a, a pop up that said uh, porn zombies all over. Yeah, it's, it's, it was uh, quite amusing to our feeble little brains. Um, and I'm going to start in Saudi Arabia. I'm going to see how we do in Saudi Arabia again. Boom! Capitalism begins in Saudi Arabia. Infected its first human, weak and used to hot temperatures, it must evolve using DNA points to infect more people. Okay, so what I think we're going to do is we're going to be going with um, saliva, blood, etc. And we'll go kind of here. Um, I'm not sure about this segmented genome. I'm not sure exactly what it does. But it's quite expensive, especially later on. So, so yeah, we'll... we'll uh, just keep going for new. And what I wanna what I really wanna try and do is Necrovirus identified Yeah. I mean identified I think isn't actually you know, we haven't been found or anything. Uh, we're just getting started. Okay. Well, plans are plans. They're made to change or something. Um, at the end of the day, well, we're not going for air then. We'll go for C because uh, I think we'd have to. Yeah, no, it's just that's not going to be very, very useful, really. I'm not sure how good the orange. I don't really use the orange thing, but the thing with doing the cure for the zombies is even after the cure's done. Top notch mine opens in Sweden. Ah, oh, top notch, yeah. Ha! <laughs> uh. Oh dear. Um, so, first off, saliva, go. And uh, does that increase the severity? No, it doesn't. We're fine. Alright. Yeah, the severity is what tends to get you noticed. Uh, well, along with, uh, you know, kind of how how many there, is, there are. And so, if, we, if we've got a bonus for popping those orange DNA bubbles, how come we only got one there? Hmm. 
Maybe the orange DNA is not a good one to go with. Well, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, five times as many people over 100 by 2013, says RMS Study. Um, so yeah, I'm really not sure how I'm going to uh, run this, really. Um, <clears throat> we'll do another saliva, and then we'll go for water. Um, I do also kind of want to do blood. Uh, um, no, we'll, we'll leave blood, because uh, it's not actually that helpful, because it's in uh, poor countries, and we're not starting in a poor country. Uh, what we might do... <coughs> is, uh, this. There we go. Okay. Oof. Um, and we'll go, we'll go bat to start off. Bat, bat one. Because, uh, uh, hard to detect. So they, they won't be spotted, but it'll boost infectivity quite nicely. If, however, bats start attacking people, I think, you know, that'll, that'll get a little bit sus sus suspect, so we won't go quite that far. Ugh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah, the, the, uh, there, there's a certain amount of waiting around at the beginning. As you guys will probably know, most of you are repeat viewers, um... Those of you found behind the sofa. Oh. Um, those of you who aren't. Why is it suddenly... Okay, we just had a, a, a minor thing there. F fair enough, fair enough. Uh, we will get water. One. We might get water. Two later. See, it's, it's not going to help our initial spread. Although it will, water will, of course, help um, moving out from here. But with the plane, um, with with the plane movement uh, restricted, it's going to be harder to spread from from Saudi Arabia because the planes were where they go. They go kind of boom, 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 boom all over the place. It's really quite a nice uh, uh, infectivity infection spread from the plane. So I kind of feel like I should go planes at the same time. I also kind of don't think I should. Um, oh god, it's going to be an interesting one. Okay, bat one, we will go with bat one. Thirteen. Oh, we hit uh, East Africa and South Africa. That's not too bad to start off. Thirteen, we've hit bats, goo. We got bats. Uh, and then you can see, if you go back to... Genetic activation causes bats to mob and attack humans at night. Uh, increases infectivity and can be lethal. You see it infects, it, it, it increases the severity as well. Um, so it's it's not really uh, uh, massively valid. Senkaku Island Sink. Diplomats relieved. Good, good. I don't know what Senkaku Island is. I'm assuming it's somewhere um, off the coast of Japan, probably. Or in the kind of Pacific area here. Dictator demands solar eclipse on birthday. Well, that's reasonable. Um, <clears throat> okay, if we go into symptoms now, we're going to start increasing in severity. That's something we don't want to do. Something we do want to do is drug resistance. Uh... A genetic hardening will be a nice one to do, probably. And uh, we also want to do here cold resistance because we're in hotter place. So if we can if we can grab these for the moment, well while we're while we're spreading about a bit, we do also want to grab water too. I think. Um, <clears throat> how much is water to to get? It is sixteen. We can get that fairly. Not too bad. Um, yeah, that's not... See, the thing is, is if we, if we, uh, if we mutate, 
and get discovered if we mutate a, um, a symptom uh, it's gonna cost me to devolve and you know I just don't want to do that because it's not a great idea um, especially with the zombies later on you really need all the DNA points you can muster and, and save and scrimp so again that's part of the reason why I'm being very cautious as to how much I spend how are we doing in Saudi Arabia? Hundred thousands, few in Egypt, South Africa, yeah. Um, and again, the plagues, uh, the disease, it takes longer to spread, even with high infectivity. Uh, when you first start off in a place, it does take quite a long time to spread. So you have to be very aware of this and uh, and plan accordingly, which is why it's nice to have. Uh, a, a fairly quick spread. Um, oh, well, we got Madagascar. That's not bad. We're, we're basically going to be, hopefully, moving up into the Europe and Asia. Um, we've got Africa. It will keep spreading around there. And hopefully, we can get a couple of uh, boats off to other places as time goes on. Um, yes, well, that's just South Africa again, really, isn't it? Um, okay, well, we need 16 for Water 2. We'll grab Water 2. Hope We've got a few places that have ships. Hopefully we can start spreading out a bit more. Um, and, yeah, I'm not sure what this whole boost to DNA from clicking oranges is. Because it doesn't seem to be working. Festival of Love in the Middle East, which is right there. We've already got saliva, so that should actually really increase the spread quite quickly. Um, <clears throat> I'm not sure when we're going to get spotted. I'm not sure if, if when this completely fills up we get spotted or if we can fly under the radar a little bit longer. But we could do with infecting some new places. I'm not complaining, just saying. Um, hmm. Well, all of these places we've infected so far we should be fairly quick at spreading. There we go. Water 2 will do it. Um, it doesn't help... <coughs> Pardon me. It doesn't help as much with the... That's just a really roundabout way to go. Wow. We did manage to send out a plane. Okay. And now, yes, you can see what I mean about the, about the spread from Saudi Arabia. You see, I've already sent out, I guess because we're full. Cold resistance one. Beautiful. That is seximification. Yeah, so you can see where the where the planes go from Saudi Arabia. You know, you've got a couple of uh, islands which are, can be difficult to, to find, to get. Uh, we've got the US, we've got um, kind of uh, Western Europe, we've got Russia, we've got Japan. Um, you can see quite how great slash useful i mean new zealand china can i was gonna say canada yeah um which would be completely wrong um and yeah so that's beautiful 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 what we will do is get cold resistance now get uh, genetic hardening now there we go so if we do get spotted we have a little more time for maneuverability to start uh Zomba, Zomba for Mackaying. And another good one. Iceland. And the UK, yeah, no, literally, Saudi Arabia is a brilliant place to start from. Um, you have to prepare for the cold, but aside from that, it's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Oh. Let's have a look. So you can see the places that aren't infected. We have three islands. We have Greenland, we have the Caribbean, and we have, uh, thank you, geography lessons, the Philippines. Of course, of course, of course, I knew that, obviously. Um, and yeah, you know, that's that's a really good start. Already these places are, are you know, early on infected. Uh, and we got South America too now. Uh, so, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll keep spreading and... Uh, I think I kind of feel like we should start symptoming um, because it, it can still evolve, you know, these 
uh, and once we've got further on, on on the symptoms yeah uh, so if we let's save up a little more DNA let's push out the the infectivity all at once um, so hopefully we'll infect a few more places we'll get some DNA from just spreading the infection as we infect more of the world uh, so you can see we oh no I was thinking that was 400,000 for some reason it's 600 million um, Well, yeah, we haven't been spotted yet. We should. I, th I think, you know, the speed with which the infection goes uh, can be a bit OTT. The speed at which the cure goes can be a bit OTT if you hide for too long. Um, so I think if well, once we get to 20, we'll push out some symptoms, get our infectiv inf infectivity up. They'll start curing us, um, but hopefully it won't be that. Okay, well, insomnia's gone. Uh, we're not going to devolve it. We should be spotted fairly soon. What do we? Uh, okay, so let's hypersalivation, polyphagia, gastroenteritis. We need ten for that. New minor disease spreading. There we go. They've spotted us. Hopefully, it won't uh, snowball too heavily. Uh, Middle East starts working on a cure. Yeah, no, there's people. People starting to work on the cure. Okay. Luckily, we basically straight away started working on autophagia. Increases infection rates. We want to go down to here to cannibalism 23. It also increases uh, lethality a little bit. We haven't hit Greenland yet. Have we hit? We have. Uh, have we hit the? We haven't hit the Philippines. Scientists con concerned about capitalism. Early analysis of capitalism in South Africa has identified cellular regenerative abilities which could cause tumors. Government zo government zombies. Government promises to take actions. Those capitalist zombies. Ugh. Uh, no, we need more. We need more. They're shutting down the airports, uh, and some of them are shutting down ports. But to be honest, with the zombie, uh, with the zombie stuff, it's not as okay. We need fifteen to to get to the next bit. With the zombies, you can uh, you know do something about that, basically. Um, yeah, and the dead, the dead, the the deaths will start to rise. I was about to say the dead will start to rise. That's not quite yet. Okay, thank you. So yeah, um... <coughs> London Olympics infect UK. UK was already infected. You see, uh, with the with this area, it's not... You know, the, hum the water will help um, with the spread, really. So... Uh, in a usual game, I would be screwed by now because the Philippines and the uh, Caribbean. But um, Spain leading global cure effort. Okay, the cure is going quite quickly. We need to jump out and into zombies as a as, as ASAP apparently. Although, again, the the randomness with when you get your DNA points. Like, you know, I'm infecting a lot of people, but I'm not getting much, uh... See, seven DNA points to devolve. You know, that's how much it costs, it's not how much you get as a refund. So you have to be careful. And we killed a few people, but, um... We can't zombie them for Kai. Um, until we get 15, because that's the... the the dead turn to zombies. Uh, we need 16. Maybe I should actually have uh, have gone for the cure DNA, the the cure from from science. There we go. All right. 
Capitalism begins to reanimate the dead. Catalyst is starting to turn infected corpses into zombies and will grow more powerful over time. Humanity has no idea what's about to happen. Um, so yeah, we've infected quite a lot. Um, the, the Hopefully, as time goes on, we'll start to... Horde Instinct, we want that. Uh, we also want... Regenerate, regener regenerative. No, we want more. We, we what we want next is we want more lethality. Um, however, what we do want to do is do this. There to there. Beautiful. We just want to infect these places. We don't want to. Uh... Yeah. Forty-one percent. Okay, I reckon we can do some fair damage if we cannibal, not cooperating with police. Of course he isn't. Um, how are we doing here? We've got everywhere except for two. Okay. <sighs> Capitalism could be miracle cure. It could be, but it's not going to be. Blath salts blamed for cannibalism surge. Okay, where are all the... Okay, so the zombies are kind of spreading fairly decently. The cure isn't going too quickly. I think maybe if we'd revealed ourselves a little bit earlier, um, or possibly a little bit later. Um, okay, so how many zombies we've got? We've got 11,000 there, so go to there, guys. Canada's clean. Um, we'll have to reinfect that damn place. Well, there aren't any zombies there. There are, there are infected. There we go. Okay, so what do we need? We need fourteen for that ne that next one. Because what will happen is that all these people who are, yeah, okay, that's the only place left that isn't infected at all. Uh, fever symptom mutated. That is fine. Um, it increases infectivity, but that's not going to help once we have... Unfortunately, we don't get any points for devolving, which is a shame. Um, oh. uh, as long as they stay there for a while. Um, we need to up the lethality of the... Of, of the people infected as soon as possible. Or we could cut back the... How much is that? 10 DNA points. We could cut this back. Uh, cut, cut back the cure a little bit. And for 10 DNA, DNA points, it might actually be worth it. Were they setting up their new base? Germany? Yeah. Okay. Um... Come on, come on, give me, give me, give me points. See, the thing is, is again, it gets worse as time goes on. Um, <clears throat> there we go. Let's cut back the cure. I think uh, we need 16 for that. Okay, hopefully we can we can get the the cure cut back again. Uh, basically, I just want more time to in infect people uh, and get more zombies. Basically, the more zombies we have, the better and the easier it's going to be for us. You can see the zombie, the dead's going up, but the zombies are going down because now they're over there. And you can, again, you can see a lot of people infected. Uh, panic spreads, Saudi Arabia falls. Okay, yeah, no, the zombies are starting to... Ah, damn, we're not going to have enough time. Okay, well... See, once, once the cure's been deployed... What, once the cure's been deployed, then all these infected people who are dying will slowly be cured. And you'll see this go down. Like, this will keep going up, which is which is fine. But uh, the, the, the cure will start becoming a bit of a pain in the arse, basically. Oh, okay. Oh, and there goes... Mexico, there goes Japan? No, not Japan. There goes... Oh, Korea's gone. Um, okay, so what we want to do 
uh, virus slowing decomposition I want to slow decomposition a little bit I'm not sure I should have done that really um, okay so do we have zombies we have zombies there we have zombies there uh, if we do zombies from there to there <clears throat> we'll infect Greenland you can see there are there are places of course that don't have any zombies at all hurrah hurrah um, where are they going? Australia? Yeah, Australia. Okay. No, they're going to New Zealand. Rotting zombie washes up on the beach of Sweden. Which means that there's a zombie in Sweden. It probably won't help, unfortunately. Um, okay, so what we want to do is we want uh, the horde mentality zombies increased to thousands. We have now infected. Uh, it's probably not going to help, but we've infected Greenland. Possibly. It doesn't seem to have worked. Like, the zombies got there and died instantly. Um, okay, so. Uh, the, the, this is this is one of the problems we ha I have um, with, the, with the zombie kind of bit of everything is that. Wait, let's hold off on that. See if we can. Yeah, okay, there you go. Uh, now we've got hundreds of thousands of zombies when we move, so we can go from example uh, this place to Sweden. Morocco bombs infected cities. Morocco is over here somewhere. Okay, and uh, let's do let's do. Uh, Where's, a, where's somewhere with, with lots of zombies but no need? Well, let's go from here to here. We'll go move, move over towards Japan. It's it's hard to tell which places are completely destroyed, which places aren't, and yeah, incredibly frustrating. Okay, uh, UK has been destroyed. Let's take them from the UK to Greenland. And we'll also, when we get a chance, we'll take them from the UK to uh, to Germany as well. Because they're slowly getting rid of the zombies in Germany too. Um, again, you can see, you know, the 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 cure is is being an asshole. So all of these places are dead. It means it's probably worth putting them over into Brazil, and you'll see. Hopefully, yeah, the the zombies breached Greenland. Uh, if I'd been a little more prepared, I might have been able to kind of see to this fairly easily, you know, like the zombies would have gone there and then they would have just destroyed uh, the Z-Com before it started. Oh, okay. They're going to Brazil, right, well let's uh, just see about that, shall we? And there we go. More zombies in Brazil. Um, oh, god damn. I think I'm going to fail this one, to be honest. Uh, unfortunately. I'm not going to do too badly, but it really is bloody difficult. Uh, there goes Central Asia. How are they doing in... Okay, there. Yeah. Let's move some more zombies from here to here. Uh, the problem, the problem I have really is, and then yeah, you get stuff like that as well. Beautiful. Um, yeah, the problem I have is the the zombies tend to disappear very very quickly. Um, and you know, if you if you focus on non decomposition, if you focus on hordes, you know, it can it can. I I feel like I have to. I feel like it would be better to focus less on transmission and just go straight for symptoms almost and you know go straight into the the whole zombie thing and I don't know uh, <sighs> Canada will be fine um so yeah like the thing is is once the cures deployed you lose a lot of infected 
Um, and there's, you can see the zombies are, are going down very, very quickly and heavily. Um, well, whew. places is being getting destroyed, but yeah, I, I, I do want to kind of go, to kind of work my way into here. Um, and with these, you know, slowing the decomposition, and you know, you can act active ability enables effectively reanimating. So if you have a place where they kill all the zombies, you can just reanimate a whole load of corpses. That can be very useful. Uh, focus on the horde leader, focusing the horde on the direction of travel, increasing travel speed. Um, you know, a lot of these, I think. Hmm. Saudi Arabia has been destroyed. But yeah, no, it's um it's you know, you can see how quickly you lose the the zombies in this. Um hmm. Well, we'll 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 see next time. I will do I will probably do another one. Um and I will I will of course stream uh, more of more of uh, Plague Inc. evolved. I think after I after I do the uh, after I do the the subscriber special on Sunday, I mm, will probably scale back the the Plague Inc. evolved videos because I've done a lot of them. Um, and you know, if something new comes out for it, or, or you know, we hopefully when we've got the uh, the multiplayer aspect of it, let's just speed towards the end. Uh, hopefully, when we've got the multiplayer aspect of um, of of this game, we'll uh, have we'll, we'll we'll have some co-op with someone. We'll, we'll we'll see who, possibly Tim, possibly Cubal, who knows? It could be anyone. Uh, okay, so well, if we just go like that, then we got that, and you know, you've got the involuntary moving movement keeps zombie connect coordinated with horde, improving speed. Horde can drift in in sea, increasing ocean, ocean travel. So yeah, I think one thing it's worth getting is uh, the popping cure bubbles. The orange DNA really didn't seem to help me that much, to be honest. Nuclear attack on Peru. There's no one there. Maybe there was until the nuclear attack. Um. So. <clears throat> Yeah, we have 15 million zombies left. Most of them are fairly spread out, it looks like. Uh, we did destroy... Oh, we didn't destroy Greenland. Oh, shit. Where are, where are my zombies? There's some in the US. Oh, there's some in Iceland. How many are in Iceland? 18. <clears throat> you can see how quickly they're going down as well. Ah, they're all in the Ukraine. Okay. Well, let's no, let's let's not move a few because we can't move a few. Um, yeah, it's towards the end when you don't get any DNA points. You know, you have to keep destroying places, and and uh, it kind of it, it very much. I feel like maybe what you want to do is you want to start in a corner, and you know, if you kind of take over, for example, South South uh, America, and then you kind of move your zombies and you just kind of flow them around the map. I think. Drifting fermentation ability. That's uh, that one there. Doesn't really help me now, but uh, I could have used with a few ability mutations earlier, guys. Just saying. So you can see the zombies. They kind of the it goes a bit more up and down. Um, Zcom also is a bit of an ass. Yeah, no. If if I had the ability to move hundreds of thousands, I could have actually probably destroyed Zcom. Maybe. But yeah, I'm thinking for next time, possibly you start in Argentina, and go go shipping, go go with water, and uh, just possibly just water like saliva water, possibly just that, uh, and then just kind of you know work on uh, symptoms quickly, and uh, and everything. So we'll see, we'll see. But um, it'd be interesting to do that as well. I have not beaten. 
uh, Zcom. I have not beaten this yet on. Uh. So yeah, how many are left? Just kill the damn zombies off already, guys. I'm not getting any points for it anyway. I think all of four million. Yeah, basically all of the zombies left are in the Ukraine. Are there any others? The Ukraine, a few in Asia. I think that's the Middle East. Yeah, Middle East has got 30,000. <clears throat> well, um, someone will be happy to know that I didn't do much to Finland. Only, uh, only 684,000 dead. There's many left still alive. So Finland... That's Sweden. Finland, you survived the zombie apocalypse. Congratulations. Oh. And yeah, you see, we can't devolve it anything. Uh, here, they all cost a lot. Even if we were to. Even if we were to. Oh. Yeah, and, and again, you know, it's it's quite they're very quick to cure uh from brutal onwards. So it's it's it does make it very that's the real kicker. Brazil shuts down the internet. The, there are no more zombies left there, guys. Zcom lockdown complete in Spain. I barely did anything to Spain to be honest. And it literally is pretty much just uh, the Ukraine left. So well done Ukraine, and the Middle East is basically free of zombies, they've got a thousand left. Did kill a lot of people in the Middle East. 900, 800, slowly going down. Yeah, I did, I did smack up the speed for this because it can take a long, a long while for the zombies to be stamped out. Oh, where are they going? France, maybe? Uh, Middle East is clear, now it's just the Ukraine. Well, as the lost zombies are hunted to extinction, I think, you know, regardless, they're probably going to uh, have some issues. Poland's dead. Uh, the, the, I think we'll probably kill the Ukraine, to be honest. Just a, a last a last zombie hurrah. Capitalism did not destroy the world. Who could have predicted that? Um, yeah, well, it's going to take a little while. So I'll do my I'll do my kind of sign off now, as it were. Um, so yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Um, if you're interested in seeing what the subscriber special is. Uh, when I do it on Sunday uh, for Plague Inc. Evolved. Um, stick around, chuck me a sub, and uh, yeah, I'll, uh, it, it should be coming along on Sunday. It's a, a, it's a fairly frightening prospect. Oh, God's sake. Come on, just either die or kill the Ukraine. Um, corpse decapitation webinar. That's uh, lovely. So, yeah, basically, um, I will be doing a something involving Play Game Evolved for my sub subscriber special. Uh, I hope to see you there. Aside from that, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'll be scaling back my my uh, project... Uh, my project's on void, no. Uh, <coughs> I'll be scaling back my, uh, my Play Game Evolved uh, videos slightly now because um, you know I've, I've done a lot of them and you know I've I think I've I've done most of what I need to with Project Zomboid and I can move on to other games and other videos but yeah thanks for watching guys I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, when this when the final zombie has croaked his last in the Ukraine I don't think we're gonna destroy the Ukraine to be honest um, I'll see See you in the next one.
So. Bite hotline. Ah, they're going really bloody slowly. I'm going to get to like 2020 or something. Well, there's 2019. <sighs> oh, dear. US lost a lot of people. Is there anywhere that went very untouched? Uh, 20,000, 90,000. That's the world. 6,000 in New Zealand. Uh, holy crap, the Caribbean nearly got killed. 25,000 Central America. 1,000 Canada. That's probably going to be the, uh, the place where the least people died. Unless it's like Spain. 3,000 Spain, yeah, no, people people died a lot over here. Uh, and yeah, so I think it's going to be 1,479 in Spain, yay! Uh, no, Spain? Canada, yay, Canada! Come on, seriously, guys, just... Sort that shit out. If we could, what I'd do now is, you know, use that ability, the regenerative, regenerative activation... Because you can literally just go to, say, for example, here and raise, like, millions and millions of zombies. Um, it's fucking hilarious. Especially especially in a country that almost died, like... Um, well, Mexico did die. Uh, like the Caribbean. And you can raise, like, millions of zombies and just go, Right, uh, if you have the horde to this point, where zombie hordes are millions strong, you can literally raise and then move on to another place. Unfortunately, at this point, you know, you don't have that much uh, in the way of DNA to do that repeatedly, but, yeah. Huh. Oh. It's got to be a race to see whether it gets to tw 2020 or whether it gets, uh, whether the zombies get exterminated before then. Ah. Got a really itchy back recently, and I don't know why. But hey, while we're waiting and I'm just babbling, why don't I um, itch my back? <sighs> no, I think it's going to get to 2020 before the zombies are exterminated. All ZCOM needs to do is set up in the Ukraine, and then it would all be done, and we can all move on with our lives, or, you know, or deaths, as it were. But no, we're sitting here slowly watching the Ukraine almost get killed. I mean, they're not going to at this point. Uh, let's have a look at this quickly. Uh, yeah. There's 20,000 infected, 40, uh, 20,000 healthy, 40,000 uh, zombies. Either way, you know, once it's dead, I might have enough to make it do a horde. But, you know, where would I go? And... Uh, Photophobia, yay! Uh, it really doesn't mutate that much, the zombie, uh, the zombie virus. It might possibly be going, be worth going into the, I know this is going to end up making things last longer, sorry guys, but going into these and increasing the mutation chance, possibly. Just like doing a round of those and ignoring the water and, and everything. Possibly. Uh, you can see the problem here is that my lethality was so low, so I didn't have many zombies. Um, you know, I did a decent job. I took out 5 billion people. Well, 5 billion, 700 million people. Wasn't quite enough, but, uh, yeah. Not a bad, not a bad, not a bad attempt in, in any one's books. France shuts down the internet. Why? How are we doing? 17,000, 17,000. Okay, we're pretty much at the end now, guys. So we'll just let the final minutes run to the run to the run to the last. Uh, and I will say again, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, hopefully, I'll be able to do. I might attempt one more recording of Brutal uh, on with the zombie Necroa virus. 
and uh, see if I can destroy the world. If I don't, or if it just is too difficult at the moment, if I can't get my brain around it, um, the video may never come to light. But we'll, we'll see, we'll see. I might do a little practicing on uh, on on Twitch, do, you know, do, a, do a little streaming of, of this and, and practice on Twitch. Um, oh, Sheepdog42, by the way, uh, twitch.tv forward slash sheepdog42 if you're interested in uh, checking out my streams. And yeah, um, I, I, I'll i see, and maybe if I be actually manage to beat it um, on Twitch, then I might just upload that uh, that part of the stream for you guys to, to see how I actually did it. Holy crap, they're dying slowly. Like, this is the thing, you have a shit ton of zombies somewhere, and they just drop, you know, they drop so quickly. When you've only got a few left, yeah, they, they hang on for ages. Armed gangs in Central Africa. Well, that's really going to help me. How many healthy people left? 12,000 healthy people left in the Ukraine. Dun, 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 dun. I think the zombie... Uh, I think I think there are still tweaks needed to be made to this game to kind of balance it in the harder thing in the harder difficulties. Um, I understand the whole kind of you know making things more difficult for you, but the cure really does seem to just burn itself. You know, it seems to lash out really quickly and just cure you very very quickly. There we go. No more zombies. Capitalism has been eradicated. There we go guys, thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, it took 2,406 days to do all that, uh, and yes, um, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one.